Hey, what's going on everyone? This is iReviews back with another video and today I will show you guys the part 13 of the top 10 CD tweaks compatible with iOS 10 up to iOS 10.2. Finger touch. This tweak brings gestures to the touch ID. So we have some simple ones like touch once to go to the home, double touch here to go to the app switcher or you can go ahead and triple touch here to activate the flashlight. So let's try this one, two, three. You can see it will turn on the flashlight. That's pretty cool. Or others like you can tap and then tap once more and hold to go to the last used app. So tap, tap once more and hold it and it will send you to the last app that you have used. This is pretty cool. So under settings here, we have an enable button. You can enable vibration here on swipe and also on finger down. Then you can set the vibration here and also the gesture wait time with these sliders. And then here you have the actions. So you have touch, hold, double touch, triple touch, and touch and hold. So you go to one of them and you can pick here what action. So you can see you have quite a lot of actions here. You can pick what action you want to do using that gesture. Smart VPN. This is a very useful tweak if you like to use VPN on your iOS 10 device. So if you're using VPN but you don't want to use it on all of your apps, you have just a few selected apps where you want to use it, then you can install this tweak and just come here and enable any of the apps where you want to use the VPN. And then once you open those apps, it will automatically enable the VPN. So as you can see there, I enabled it on the App Store and you can see here, once I open the App Store, it will also activate the VPN. Alert, this tweak will bring the TV OS style alerts to your iOS 10 device. So you can see here, if I wanna delete an app, you can see the alert here looks way more different than the stock of iOS. It looks just like the Apple TV OS. So let's go to the settings of this tweak. Here we have an enable button. You can use a wallpaper as the background of the alert or you can set a color right here. So you pick any color you want and you can also change the amount of blur and the size of the alert. Slide to unlock 10. This tweak will bring back the slide to unlock on your iOS 10 device. So you just swipe like this as usual as we did to swipe on iOS 9 and below. So you just swipe from the left side to the right like this and it will open your device. And if you have a passcode, when you swipe, it will send you to the passcode view. So you will need to enter your passcode. But if you don't have a passcode, you just slide to unlock and it will unlock your device. Insta volume. This tweak will bring the Instagram volume hood to iOS 10. So you can see the volume hood right here at the top of my device. So you can see it here. It won't show the volume hood on the middle, but it will show it on the top here, just like on Instagram. If you go to the settings of this tweak, you have an enable button, then you can change the location of the volume hood. And then here you can change the color. So you have the foreground and the background color. You go here and pick any color that you want. Control my center. This is a tweak for the control center and it will bring a couple of new features to the iOS 10 control center. So first of all, it will change the color of the Wi-Fi from blue to green. Also, it will add the low power mode button. So you tap there and it activates the low power mode and also the screen recording button here. So you tap on it. It starts recording the screen of your device. Once you're done, you come back, you tap once more and it will finish recording and it will save the video to your photo library. Fast delete. This tweak will disable the word, the word deletion. You know that when you're deleting something on your iOS device, it will hang for a bit and then it will start deleting word by word. But with this tweak, it will just delete letter by letter. So you can see here how fast it goes through them. It doesn't hang at all. The tweak doesn't have any options to configure. All you have to do is install it. No blur. This tweak will completely remove the blur from your device. So you can see here, if I open the notification center, no blur at all here. Or if I go here to the search on the home screen, also no blur. If I open a folder here, no blur. That looks pretty awesome. So let's jump to the settings of this tweak and see what we have to configure here. So you go to no blur, you enable it here. Then here you have the universal settings. So you enable it here and then you can go ahead and customize it. So you can customize it for the system wide or for any of your apps. And also you can also replace blurs right here. So you enable it and then you set here the individual options. So you come here and you set the amount of blur for the lock screen folders, notification center, app switcher and stuff like that. 
Respring Progress. This tweak will replace the normal Respring screen of your iOS 10 device with this white screen if you have a white iPhone, of course, and a black screen if you have a black iPhone, and you will see the progress bar just like you see when you update or when you're restoring your device. Tap Tap Folder. This is a simple tweak for the folders. Now, normally you tap once to open a folder, but with this tweak, you can double tap and it will open the first app on that folder without even opening the folder at all. All you have to do is just double tap on the folder icon and it will open that app. So that's it for this video guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this week's for more videos like this, make sure you subscribe, also go ahead and leave a like on this video as it helps out a lot, and if you haven't already, go ahead and follow me on my social media, you will find all the links in the description of the video.